There have been about 110,000 opioid related deaths in the U.S. last year. That's according to the U.S. Drug Enforcement Agency. Now the DEA is dealing with a new drug related problem. They say drug traffickers are using emojis with coded messages to find buyers. WEAR's Shade Ray joins us. And Shade, these dealers, they have found a new platform, we understand, to avoid getting caught. Bob, Sue, we use emojis every day while we're texting. They're normally used to express emotions, not anymore. Texting and social media is an easy way to talk with people. Emojis are being used every day, even as code to talk about drugs. It's turned anyone's living room into a place where they can purchase illegal drugs. So it's no longer you have to get in a car or find a ride to some dark street corner where, you know, in a shady part of town and um, meet with some unknown person and, 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 and conduct a drug, drug transaction. The U.S. Drug Enforcement Administration created a decoder for emojis they've seen in their investigations. It could be as simple as this. For meth, you can use these symbols. If you want a large batch, you can text a cookie. Assistant Special Agent in Charge Mike Duvet says these codes are ever-changing. I would think just like coded language is on the phone, coded emojis or using emojis to code their what they're talking about is, is just it's up to the imagination and, and they can get as creative as they they'd like on those. Clinical supervisor Darlene Watts says it's important to look out for things that doesn't seem right in your child's phone. Both Watts and Dubet encourage having open conversations to make children aware of the dangers of opioids like fentanyl. Being that this is so real to some because of their kids dying from this and parents are, are dying as well. This is no one is exempt from this. This isn't everybody's family, whether we all are aware of it or not. Dubet tells me fentanyl is laced in all other illegal drugs and access on social media can be dangerous. So you're you're you literally have a higher chance of ODing than not when taking a fake pill or one of these pills. Um, so it's plain Russian roulette with your life and um, the, the odds are against you right off the bat. We're providing information on our website to help you identify how emojis are being used and what drugs they represent on social media. Live in the studio, Shade Ray, WEAR News.